Reference to flying machines can be seen on 41 separate occasions in the Mahabharata, one of the world's oldest books. The air attack on the Dwaraka deserves special mention. For example, there are references to King Salva's attack against Dwaraka, the city where God Krishna lived. In this epic war, Salva pilots a flying vehicle called Sabha, which has superpowers and can even make itself invisible. Krishna returns the attack with lightning that locates and destroys his enemies through sound. Another verse speaks of an aerial chariot with the sides of iron and clad with wings. How is it possible that bona fide ideas concerning aviation were present in an era regarded as the early days of civilization?